So a comment I've been getting a lot is about the softness in some games in GeForce Now, especially Ubisoft games. There's a fantastic filter that I love from NVIDIA, the Sharpen filter. I've used it a ton on local PCs to increase my frame rate and image quality. I have a video I'm going to link in the description below doing it in Modern Warfare on a local machine if you'd like to see this filter used uh, that way as well and explain there. So here I have three presets of 50%, 75 and 100. You can also make shortcuts in here so you don't have to bring up the menu which is control G to bring that menu up. Film grain, I don't use in any of my games. I can typically leave this just set to the 15, but it may be something that you need to mess around with. As far as my sharpen, most of the time I'll be running 80 when I'm gaming, but I just set up mostly a 50, 75, and 100 for testing. Um, and we'll be comparing none to 100 as well. So we're going to have some side-by-side -side as well, some full screen, and uh, a little bit of Watch Dogs uh, after Valhalla so that we can see how that game's looking as well, just in, just in a couple of scenes. Uh, we'll take a look at Valhalla a bit more closely uh, because the Sharpen Filter really does a lot for this game, in my opinion. And what I love about the NVIDIA Sharpen Filter is that it, they don't tend to necessarily over sharpen. I know some people don't really like it, especially all the way up to 100%, and I do get it. Uh, you know, that's why you need to fine tune it for what you really like, what screen you're using, monitor, and so forth. Everybody's going to have something different that they like to use here, but this filter does a great job of taking that fuzziness and blurriness out of the games. So here's full screen, no filter. We're going to switch to 50% right here and watch for changes in things like the rock ground, the wood, finer details in the grass. We'll switch over to 100% on our sharpen right here. Again, it may start to look slightly over sharpened. We'll go back to none. And the image will, especially out in the distance, if you look at that big tree, gets much more blurry. So moving over to a building here, just kind of closer to the rock. Uh, here's no filter at all. And now we're going to switch to the 100% right here. And it really brings out the detail in the hay on the bottom, the wood, the rock in front of us. We'll go back over to none. It gets a good bit blurrier there. It's a very soft game anyways, especially on GeForce Now. And we'll do a side-by-side -side of those for you. No filter on the left and the 100% there on the right. So going over to the same spot right here... Um, Difference in the character model and, and everything is going to be a lot here with the sharpening filter. And here you go. That That is just a... I know the lighting is different. Unfortunately, the sun does what it does in this game. But you can really see the difference right there of what the filter is doing. So let's switch over to Watch Dogs. Now, this is running none right now. We're going to go through this game a little bit quicker. I think you're getting the point. I really want you to go play with this filter and see what works for you. Switch over here to 100%, and you'll see his hair uh, detail start to come out, the leaves out there in the distance, detail in the road. Uh, the Sharpen Filter does a lot to bring all that out here at 100%. Again, I do tend to like to run around 80. So side by side here, standing next to this, again, the no filter on the left, 100% on the right. And you can see a good bit of difference in the detail popping out of the stone in the building, the plant there in front of him, the hair again, that type of thing. So... All right, guys, I think this pretty much just shows you. I want to make a really quick video for this. It's just go into there, hit control G, start playing with the sharpen filter, uh, set up some presets, some shortcuts if you want to, and really have fun with this and get some of these games looking a little bit sharper for you out of GeForce Now. Thanks a lot for coming and check out the video. I really appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't. Thumbs up, ring the bell, comments, all of that. Again, really appreciate you coming to check it out. See you guys in the next one.